Hey y'all, this is Zach with Meals Under Pressure. All right, tonight I'm gonna show you the absolute best way to cook one of these pre-seasoned, pre-packaged pork tenderloins or pork loins. Um, this is a Smithfield. This is what we normally get at our grocery store. Uh, this is the roasted garlic and black pepper. They've got teriyaki, they've got hickory smoke, whatever, you know, whatever flavor you want. All right, real simple. So now I've cooked these on the grill, I baked them, I've cooked them in my Instant Pot which is probably the second best way of cooking them. But the air fryer, absolute best. Tenderness, juiciness. All right, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this out. I'm not even gonna brown it. All right, it's pre-seasoned. I'm gonna take it out of the package. I'm gonna set my air fryer to 350 degrees. Oops, anyway. I'm gonna set it to 350 degrees and set it for 25 minutes. And that's it. Now, when I put this in there, I may need to cut it in half. I'm gonna need to see you know, if it fits in one piece or not, and I'm gonna flip it halfway, but uh, all right. So let me get it removed from the package. Let me get my, my uh, air fryer preheating, and we'll be back. So we, heat, we preheated it to 350 degrees. We set the timer for 25 minutes, and this is gonna fit in there just nicely. I don't need to cut it. So 25 minutes later, we'll be eating. So we'll see y'all in. 25. All right, so we air fried our pork loin or tenderloin at 350 degrees for 25 minutes. And we flipped it halfway through, but look how juicy this is and just tender. I'm telling y'all folks, this is the best way to cook your pork loin or your pork tenderloin. You can buy one that's that's not prepared, and you can season yourself and cook it. But uh, hands down, best way to uh, to cook one. All right, so we're gonna plate up, and we're gonna get eating, and we'll see y'all next time.